Hey everybody, what's going on? Jimmy is Promo here back again with another awesome video. And in today's video, we will be testing the ultrasonic fingerprint reader on the Galaxy S10 and the S10 Plus, seeing if we're able to get it wet. So what happens if our thumb is wet? What happens if the phone gets wet? And what happens if the phone is actually sitting in water? Are we able to unlock and use the ultrasonic fingerprint reader on the very front if our thumb or the phone is wet itself? Now, if you are brand new here at the channel of Jamia's Promo and you own a Samsung Galaxy device, don't forget to hit on that subscribe button as well as the bell for notifications so you get notified for future videos. And don't forget about that playlist tab on the very top to check out all the videos I've made for the past devices as well as the brand new S10 and the Samsung One UI. So for the first test, we're gonna do something as simple as just getting the thumb wet, placing it on there, and then seeing if it unlocked. So that one was definitely successful. Let's go through there, get the thumb wet again, place the thumbprint on there, and it also worked. Now what we're gonna do is just add a little bit more water pretty much all over the screen of this device. Uh, really, it's just adding a lot more pressure points being touched onto the screen. There's also a little bit of water droplets where the fingerprint reader is, uh, and definitely it read the fingerprint definitely easy. So sound waves is going through a little bit of water sitting on top, as well as multiple pressure points, which a lot of times kind of takes away from you using the, the device. Now what we're gonna do is place it inside of the water fully submerged pretty much where that fingerprint is and then we'll see if it's able to unlock so it looks as if this is probably going to be a no so if your phone is underneath and actually submerged inside of water um, it will definitely be a no but when you lift it out you put your thumb on there it definitely unlocks and interacts so so this was just a fun little video to see what would happen if your thumb gets wet if your phone gets wet or maybe you're taking a bath, uh, taking a shower, you're doing the dishes um, and you still wanted to use your phone, it definitely still reacts with the ultrasonic fingerprint reader. But I will also mention if there is enough water sitting on this device, so there's a lot of pressure points going on. Sometimes if you're trying to open your camera or do, or do text messages, um, it might take just a little bit longer to kind of do what you want it to do just because there is pressure points from the water. Um, but it was a pretty fun test to see how it worked. So if your thumb is wet, definitely good to go. If you have water sitting on it from a shower or bath or it's raining outside, you're also good to go. But if you are trying to unlock your device, when it is fully submerged underwater, there's too much pressure points going around that it will not register your thumbprint. So I hope that you guys have liked this video. If you guys did, please give this thing a huge thumbs up. Also, don't forget to hit on subscribe. Subscribe right over here on the very bottom left-hand side with that little red circle. Um, other than that, share this video with your friends and family and social media sites. And you know what? If you guys have Reddit, I definitely challenge you to share this video all over there. I know that a lot of people on Reddit is going to love this video, seeing that new technology is able to use ultrasonic fingerprint reader um, still when it is wet to unlock your device. And I'll see you guys later. Thank you.